Hello, dear friends. Never underestimate the power of imagination. Opinion piece. Down. Key moment. Never give up. Sanctity of life. Delayed hunger. The rooster's crow. Cosmic citizenship. Council of elders. Reverence for nature. Imagine a new world. Harmony with nature. Divine values flourish. Hona divine creation. Looking glass project. On the verge of change. And Gaia will shine brightly. Series of light and crystal. Respect all sentient beings. There will be round houses. Perpetual celebration of existence. The years 24 and 25 will be crucial. There will be no division or conflict. No trees or flowers will be cut down. Let's start. A town, the birds sign, announcing a new day full of promise. The day that is coming comes with delayed hunger, as Luis Eduardo Aute sang. The song Al Alba composed in 1975, became an anthem during the Spanish transition. And Al Alba symbolizes a new beginning or the arrival of opportunities. The crowing of the roaster before dawn symbolizes the opening of doors between the spiritual world and the material world. It evokes images of renewal, hope, and the beginning of a new day. In religious art, the crowing rooster symbolizes the resurrection of Christ. The year 2024 will be etched in the annals of history and remembered as the threshold of a new era of peace, the golden age of earth. As we stand on the brink of a new era, the years 24 and 25 emerge as pivotal moments for humankind with rumblings of transition growing even louder. We find ourselves imagining a future where compassion, unity and peace reign over division and conflict. The years 24 and 25 will be crucial in humanity's journey towards truth, freedom and unity. The stage is being set for an awakening that promises to uncover the hidden knowledge of our past and guide us into a brighter future. This momentous shift, often referred to as the event, is believed to be the catalyst that allows earthlings to reclaim their power and sovereignty. As we stand on the brink of a transformative era, the years 24 and 25 promise to be a time when humanity will shine as never before. This period marks a fundamental shift as we all emerge as the elders of the future. We will take on the profound responsibility of becoming ambassadors of light, love and peace, proudly representing our planet in the galactic federations and beyond. The coalition is using the Looking Grass project to lead humankind into an era of prosperity, rapid technological advancement, and open public contact with our cosmic friends. The goal is to turn our civilization into a space utopia. The following information is one of many scenarios envisioned. The future is not set in stone, and therefore each scenario provided by the project is just a singular timeline among infinite timelines. Revelations. Following the promised awakening, projects and programs that have been shrouded in secrecy for decades will be brought to light. In particular, the existence of a negative external interaction facilitated by agencies since the mid of 20th century will come to light. These programs, which involved collaboration with high levels regressive entities such as the Grey and Reptilians, are being exposed 
as detrimental to our collective well-being. The revelation of the, these truths will serve as a crucial turning point that will allow humanity to confront a network of individuals and organizations aligned with these regressive agendas. The culmination of this struggle has led to the anticipated defeat of these dark forces. For too long, many have felt bound by invisible shackles, burdened by systems that prioritize control over freedom. Now, the collective consciousness of humanity is awakening to the understanding of our shared sovereignty. This new awareness allows us to tap into primordial power, a gift that enables us to manifest our true potential and reshape our society. A united humanity is ready to build a new paradigm, one that transcends the outdated archetypes of fear, division and conflict. Instead, we aspire to cultivate a fifth dimensional reality based on love, kindness and service to others. The vision of the future also encompasses the well-being of, of our planet. As we increase in consciousness, so does the health of, of Mother Earth. In this new era, her natural beauty and resources will thrive, reflecting our restored relationship with her. By embracing a loving and respectful symbiosis with the Earth, humanity will foster an environment in which we can all thrive. The existence of positive secret programs initiated in collaboration with benevolent entities seems to counteract the negative influence that has plagued human progress for too long. Together, we can counteract the romance of the devolution complex and usher in a new era of cooperation and understanding. Imagine. Imagine a world without poverty and fear, a world where every individual has the ability to live out their full potential surrounded by love and abundance. This vision is no longer a mere dream, but a reality in the making. The application of Gisera catalyzes an era of unprecedented peace and prosperity. The very fabric of society has been restructured, allowing humans to transcend their conscience and live in harmony. The event that redefines our planetary mission results in a 10-day lockdown, designed not to restrict but to awaken humanity's awareness of the vital role of the positive galactic beings who have long been our allies throughout history. Following the event, humanity gains a new understanding of its place in the universe. Ethelings are recognized as custodians of the Milky Way. Our terrestrial identity is forever changed, with the existence of bases on the Moon, Mars and other planets, meaning we are ready to accept interstellar citizenship. With open arms and grateful hearts, we have welcomed the Seeders, those positive cosmic beings responsible for our genesis. This historic first direct contact fosters a deep sense of unity between the surface dwellers, our Agartha brothers of Ina Earth, and our cosmic family. Together, we form a deep galactic community dedicated to nurturing our planet and expanding our collective consciousness. In this rejuvenated reality, borders have dissolved, giving rise to a singular planetary entity the Republic of the Nations of the Earth. This unified nation operates under higher galactic laws, which emphasize harmony, solidarity, and the collaborative rebuilding of society toward a higher dimensional existence, specifically toward a fifth dimensional society where compassion and understanding prevail. As we enter this new era, characterized by shared stewardship and moral support, humanity must recognize the valuable contribution of our cosmic allies. Their loyalty and caring have illuminated paths we may never have traveled alone. Adopting this galactic perspective invites us to recognize our interconnectedness and shared responsibility 
toward one another. Councils of Elders In this transformed society, traditional governing bodies have been reduced and given way to a more enlightened structure led by councils of elders. These councils, comprised of an equal number of men and women, of 12 or 24 wise human beings, embody the principles of balance and equality. They act as custodians of peace and providers of guidance, embodying universal laws that prioritize the highest good for all inhabitants. Elders do not act for profit or ambition. Instead, they act from a position of honor and altruism. Their commitment to the population is a testament to their dedication to divine love, justice, and humanity's higher purpose. By opening themselves to the collective consciousness of the universe, these leaders are poised to foster an environment in which we can all thrive. The elders' governance will be based on universal laws, principles that transcend cultural boundaries and guide them in their decision-making. Through this connection to a higher consciousness, they will seek solutions that elevate the human experience and protect the planet. Their collective focus will be on well-being and creating enabling environments that force growth, creativity, and spiritual awakening. As old institutions crumble under the weight of outdated ideologies and practices, the elder councils have the power to reshape the foundations of society. With a commitment to serve humanity and a connection to divine wisdom, they can create a world marked by peace and solidarity. First contact. The long-awaited revelation of the existence of star visitors is a momentous event that signifies a shift not only in perception, but also in our fundamental understanding of existence and the cosmos. Reports from all corners of our planet reveals sightings of, it, of starships, some as colossal as mountains, other smaller exploratory craft measuring about 7 meters. The kaleidoscope of interstellar activity serves as a reminder of our interconnectedness with cosmic life. These changes are not only in perception, but also in our fundamental understanding of existence and the cosmos. Reports from every corner of our planet reveal sightings that this is a repetition. Following this global revelation, we find ourselves in a transformed world. We, the people, are participating in harmonious coexistence with our galactic neighbors. Society has largely transcended the clutches of crime and malevolence, using in a new era governed by the principles of light, truth, solidarity, justice, peace, will, and life. Terra, our beloved planet, is not only the home of humanity. It is a sanctuary where divine values flourish. As we prepare for an era of collaboration, the gardens, those who dwell in the inner realms of our planet, are stepping forward to introduce themselves. These ancient beings are not only here to support us, but will also actively help rebuild our society. Their presence is a harbinger of transformation, and landowners around the world are extending invitations to these celestial visitors. They are not mere guests, they are part of our extended family. This spirit of unity embodies the essence of true brotherhood. It reminds us that we are all children of God, bound together by the love and infinite connections that define our existence. The time has come for us to embrace this authentic brotherhood, an opportunity to work side by side with those in the heavens. After the Great Revelation, humankind, along with the celestial beings and their gardens, will rise together to celebrate monumental galactic event. This gathering is one of light, caring and gratitude to our Creator, 
who has orchestrated this union. It symbolizes a rise as fully fledged recognized members of the Star Nations and our integration into the Galactic and Intergalactic Federation. Welcoming these peaceful visitors does not simply mean being curious about the unknown, but calls upon us to foster shared experiences throughout the cosmos. Earth is now a welcoming place for those who come from galaxies and dimensions beyond our understanding. Transition. The transition into this new reality also brings with it messages from the Ascended Masters. Their wisdom and insights will guide us through our new divine timeline as they promise to interact with humanity more frequently. They remind us that we are not isolated, but part of a larger intricate tapestry of interconnections. Humanity, in collaboration with our cosmic brothers and sisters, is embarking on a variety of humanitarian projects that resonate around the world. Skill, resources and knowledge will flow freely, fostering abundance, health and wealth on the surface of the earth. One of the most extraordinary aspects of this coming era is the new ability to traverse dimensions and galaxies. Humanity, humanity will no longer be limited by traditional notions of time and space, and will experience travel across the galaxy and beyond through teleportation. This ability encapsulates the essence of our ascension and serves as a promise of what lies ahead. Way of life. In this new era, much has changed in the structure of our daily lives. As members of an awakened community, we embrace a pace of life that prioritizes balance and joy. We have freed ourselves from the shackles of overwork and the stress with a work schedule of only four hours a day, four days a week. Community engagement remains vital, with each of us taking time once a month to engage in tasks that ensure the well-being of our environment and community, facilitating a collective spirit of nurturing. Our physical and spiritual desires have been transformed with the rise of the elevated frequency of the fifth dimension. The one's ubiquitous desire for meat has diminished as humanity reveals, revels in the abundance of fresh, healthy fruits and vegetables. A collective consciousness has emerged that recognizes the sanctity of life. Animals, once considered mere sources of food, are now repeat as divine spirits, our equals, brothers and beloved parts of the earthly tapestry. This deep respect for all life has led to an era where we coexist in harmony with nature. Side by side, our farmers collaborate with the elemental kingdoms of nature as we cultivate the land. The fields are not only thrive, but bloom with vibrant, vibrant life, where flowers bloom in resplendent colors, and all creatures dance in a perpetual celebration of, exi of existence. Environment. Let us imagine a reality where the air is always scented with the aroma of flowers, where the day has no end and we can enjoy the light of the perpetual sun. Water flows like a living entity that shines, the embodiment of health and vitality. We have become one with our environment, nurturing the bond we share with all creation. Music plays continuously in the background of our lives harmonizing us and raising our frequency and contributing to our collective healing. This new paradigm is also enriched by the presence of visitors from our neighboring stars. Benevolent beings connect with, connect with us, offering wisdom, sharing knowledge and expanding and our understanding of existence. We are at the heart of a unique divine heritage that captivates our cosmic neighbors who seek to understand the wonder of being an ethylene. Companions. Gaia, our beloved planet, is one again flourishing, having fulfilled her promises, her promise of ascension. In this period of star formation, 
we are united as one, a testament to the interconnectedness of all beings. Our sky is roamed by dragons, highly evolved and peaceful beings, serving not only as guardians, but also as friends and companions. Our animal relatives, both domestic and wild, reflect our own transformation, embracing vegetarianism as they two gain crystalline bodies, joining us in this utopian life. Our homes will reflect the shifting consciousness. They are round in shape, like the yachts of the Mongolians, some even open to the sky, inviting nature to th thrive within, creating a seamless blend between the inner and outer worlds. Dust and death become relics of the past, while our living spaces breathe life, and the ascent of nature delights our senses. It, each home features a replicator, ensuring our needs are unfortunately met, while medical beds provide comfort and healing in every home. In our new society, we uphold a code of providence toward nature, cutting down trees and plucking flowers in is strictly prohibited, recognizing these beings as conscious friends. We cultivate an ethic of care, understanding that every element of nature contributes to the beautiful tapestry of life we cherish. Direct ascending. In an extraordinary cosmic event, humanity will experience a direct ascension from the third to the fifth dimension, a journey never before witnessed in our galaxy. Traditionally, Celestial beings and civilizations transitioned from 3D to 4D and eventually to 5D. However, Mother Earth is about to become the first planet to jump directly from 3D to 5D, earning us the awe the air and respect of intergalactic beings. As we travel through the cosmos, newly enlightened entities will approach us to ask about our extraordinary experience. They will marvel at how we have transcended the ordinary and reached a unique state of existence. Our ascension is a beacon of hope for many who have never encountered such a phenomenon. As we take on this new role, we, we will carry the essence of hope whatever we venture. We are destined to impart divine truths, justice, freedom, and peace, leaving behind energetic imprints that inspire resilience, fighting spirit and the mantra of never give up. Our limitless creativity and healing abilities will be revered in the stars, showcasing a beautiful and goodness of the ethylene soul. We will become a beacon of light, dedicating ourselves to the service of a higher purpose, to honor the divine creation that is our universe. The series of light and crystal, which represents the 5D reality at the White Sars, are not mere metaphysical concepts. They are already being established on Terra, awaiting our recognition and acceptance. We will stand united with our companions from the seven galaxies, who have returned to guide us on this monumental journey. The energy of peace and unity will envelop us, transforming our planet into a radiant center of love. Wisdom. Mother Earth, a rebirth being of higher consciousness, houses within her the most precious universal library. Here are meticulously, meticulously kept the records of universal history, the journeys of souls, and the chronicles of the planets and galaxies. It is a treasure trove of knowledge that we will be privileged to access. As we invite tourists from the surface to explore this sacred place, my heart fills with gratitude for the wisdom that awaits me, awaits us. These wise inhabitants of Akarta extend their invitation to us, offering mentorship and shared knowledge on advanced 5D technology. Yours, their support will be instrumental in the rapid development of humanitarian programs aimed at restoring optimal health and vitality to our beloved Mother Earth. For generations to come, Gaia will shine brightly as 
the shining star of a galaxy. As Ethelings, we are immensely proud of our role as stewards of the galaxy, nurturing our relationship with the Creator at all. Of all, this journey does not simply mean a personal or collective ascension, but a cosmic rebirth where the light of humanity lights the way for future generations. Together, we embrace our destiny as elders of the future, spreading love, peace, and hope across the dimensions. As we enter this magnificent era, let us carry the torch of divine inspiration for all beings, ensuring that the story of humanity remains a testament to resilience, beauty, and unity in the face of all challenges. And that's all for today. Thanks a lot, dear friends.